So today I'm going to be reading The Girl from the Sea, the graphic novel by Molly Knox Ostertag. Sorry. Sorry. But I'm going to try to uh, record my feelings and thoughts as I read it. So we're going to try something new. Um, I need to get in the car because we are going to the lake. All right. We're in the car. We're on the way to the lake. My hair is crazy. But that's okay. Uh, Daddy's in the store getting snacks and lunch. It's very exciting. Okay. So, uh, I'm about to read The Girl from the Sea. Um, and I thought that it was about mermaids. And it is actually about selkies which is so exciting because i'm from nova scotia so a lot of people i don't think know about selkies and i do so <laughs> i'm just really excited to read this book it's gonna be good oh it looks so cute <laughs> I didn't like it. I didn't like it. So the original plan was to read the book and as really cool parts came up or exciting things or just things that I wanted to talk about came up, I would tape, I would record my reaction or thoughts. Um, and honestly, I just, this is the first time that a graphic novel just didn't do it for me. Um, I liked the idea. I liked the idea of the story. I liked the general way that the story was going. Um, I, I liked the artwork. The artwork is beautiful. Um, but I just, I didn't, I wasn't feeling the story. Uh, and it makes me feel real bad because I know that I like this author who wrote uh, Witch Boy, I think it's called. Uh, I loved I loved that graphic novel. I was really excited to read this one because I knew that I really liked that one. And I just, I, I didn't love it. There were parts that came up and I was just like, but why? Like, what? That doesn't make sense. Um, and just certain behaviors of the characters just, I don't know, didn't didn't groove and jive with me. I don't, I'm not sure. Maybe it's because uh, I just finished binge-watching Heartstopper for like the sixth time uh, and the graphic novel series twice up until, of course, volume four because that's all that's out just yet. But like some of the things that the characters did. Yeah, yo, booby. What's going on? What's happening? What do you need? You want to go in there? Okay. Cool. Anyway, I just, I didn't, I didn't love it. There were certain parts, I don't want to ruin it for anyone, but there were certain parts where I just, I, it was, it was not, I, I guess I just, I didn't click with the characters. That's okay. It was still, it was a good story. I'm glad I read it. Um, I'm glad I have a story. What is up with my hair today? I'm glad I have a story about Selkies that I've read this year. You know, like, I'm never worse off from reading a book. Um, but I mean, I really, I, I very rarely even mark anything lower than a three. And right now I'm thinking 2.5. For this book which is kind of unfortunate um but here we are i i mean i just i didn't it was this is the first time that i would have been recording my reaction as i read um and for some reason i just i really didn't want the first time that i react to a book to be just negative and that's really the only thoughts that I wanted to talk about were the negative ones. I don't know. May, eh, eh, not this time. We'll try it again. 
another time. I've got more graphic novels that we can read. Those are just easier to do the reactions to. Um, I, if it's if it's a full on novel, I'll forget <laughs> to do it. So, um, but yeah. So unfortunately, it's a two point five. I feel horrible about that, but yeah. Um, whoops. I don't know. I don't know why I feel bad. I shouldn't. It's just an opinion. It's just an opinion. I'm sorry. Yeah. <laughs>